Right, morning all. It's uh, Saturday the 4th of January 2020. So happy New Year to everyone. Um, it's 8.20 a.m. Again, Saturday morning, 4th of January. Um, today I'm up at my permission. I've got a five minute walk, so I thought I'd put the camera on. Um, the only thing is, I forgot to bring the remote control from the camera. So it's going to be back to the old way of like turning the camera on and off and pressing record on and off uh, like I used to. Um, <laughs> unless I've put it in my bag and I've not, well I've not looked in my bag actually at the moment but hopefully it might be there. If not it's going to be back to the old way for the day. Uh, it is a bit chilly today. I've got holes in my trousers. Down there. and my knees are getting a bit cold so um, I think as soon as I start digging I'll uh, probably warm up now it's supposed to be kind of sunny today hopefully so uh, you know the old sunrise is coming over there just about now what I'm going to do I'm going to continue doing ones but I will actually nip on to the uh, new permission as well and have a quick walk around. I'm not. I don't think I do any milk detecting now. I might do a little bit in the wooded area. But I don't know yet. Um, I'll let her bring Tom up um, when I do start digging them anyway. Um, but I really want to try to get the ones over and done with, and then uh, get on doing uh, the new permission, and then. I'll uh, go back to doing ones again in a couple months time because uh, I, I know there's still going to be stuff on there just that you know it's been so cold wet and windy and all boggy on the ground and you know uh, the only thing with paddocks they don't actually um, use a, a tractor to dig the ground up I leave it all down to the horses so um, the, the, the soil doesn't get disturbed so there's going to be a load of stuff about just that you've got to find it oh bloody chilly guys i tell you one thing right so anyway i'm going to shut up and i'll uh, get back to you and i'll start digging right catch you later right so i'm just showing you uh i'm on the new part of the property i'm just showing the walk around shit <laughs> so they don't want to fucking attack me there's some horses here from the uh, new property it just came running up uh, I'm a bit wary about these new horses actually Well, there's only two there, but it's going to be a lot more. You know, I think the other ones behind have got used to me, but um, you know, these new ones. Look at all this mud. These new ones are going to have to start getting used to me as well. I think. You know, I know they've seen me a couple of times, but um, you know, I'll just have to see how it goes. You know, I wouldn't mind doing a part in here actually, but so I want to do Ron's first, finish Ron's um, section off, and then um, start on this in the next month or two. You know, there's a quite a bit of scrub land here. You know, you've got to possibly building, might have had a building here. Don't know. But this is all part of my new permission anyway. Just giving you a little uh, view of it.
Oh, because I'm actually just walking around the edges at the moment. You know, I just don't know what you might find in the side edge. I can only see two of the main horses at the moment on this land. I think the rest might be over there. That it looks like there's only two on today at the moment. So I've got all the rest of this field apart from square part down here. So it's quite big really. Yeah, bloody big. Um, oh, I don't know how to walk around. So, you know, it's well double than what Ron's got. More than double actually. <laughs> so I'm glad I've got this part. Yeah, it might be a bit difficult getting in there. I think they've uh, kind of like... Oh, actually you can get in there, but it's really, really muddy. It's really muddy in there. I think the other horse here, yeah, all the other horses over there. In that part. See, I wonder if it's bloody freezing. My hands are freezing cold already. So it goes all the way down to this bit, round to the um, uh, caravan. And then where those fences are over there, it goes up and round. That square bit is not anything to do with this sort of ones. So anyway, um, I'm going to turn this off because I'm going to try and see if I can find something. I'm not going to say that I can find it, but I want to find out what's over there. And I'll get back to you in a little while. So I was just thinking, because this field is a lot bigger than I expected it to be, uh, when I start doing this, I'm going to have to like, grid it, get some sticks and do like um, a grid section and just concentrate on a grid section each day because this is bigger than I expected <laughs> a lot bigger now on the map it looks like it's only a small piece of land but when you're on it it is quite big so yeah and that's where the other horses are Ron's is over there, you've got the other horses over there which come on this field which are Tom's horses and ponies those are over there just feeding right now now I could actually start doing some detecting here today but I'm not going to I want to finish off Ron's um, you know, I still want to go over some of the actual uh, land on the ones that I've already done because uh, you know it's not raining so much and it's getting a bit more drier although it's bloody cold um, I do think that there might be a possibility of me finding some more little treasures maybe a few more coins there's a hole there not mine. <coughs> Here comes a couple of the horses. So I want to try to get off here before they start coming up. I think he's got about ten horses on this one. I think one's got about seven or eight. I'd like to start doing in here 
first of all in the wooded area and then move on to the grasslands after now they're coming over just try not to show the fear because I really don't like horses that much right so I'll definitely give it to you in a little bit right so this was giving me between 60s and 70s grass don't know what it is if anyone knows what it is let me know but it's definitely grass right cheers catch you next Alright, got one here. I can actually see it in me. It's jumping at the signal. More in the 40s. And it is an iron buckle, I believe. It's uh, an iron buckle. Alright, don't think there's anything else in the hole. No, no, I've got iron turned off actually, but if it's a higher signal, then I think you're going to get it still anyway. Right, catch on next one. Got a little nosy. Little no leak. That clicking is just me zooming in. Well, I got a hit here, and I did. Um, seventy, seventy-five. Could be a coin, but it's about seven, eight inches down. So it's a coin. Let's hope it's another coin. Right. Yeah, what my plan is to do is walk up and down this hill and then when I've done up and down I'll be going crossways as well. But I think that won't happen for another couple of weeks, so I've still got all this to do yet. I think it still might be in the hole. Yep. Might be another coin, might not be, don't know. Could be a bit of lead. Wish I'd have spayed my uh, old Craig's got, it'd be a lot easier. Shotgun shell, I think. No, it ain't. It's a brass nut. Well, it's brass, but it's a nut. <sighs> it's not a Roman nut. It's not a medieval nut. It's just a modern brass nut. Okay, catch on the next one. Alright, oh, just got another coin, guys. Uh, I ain't gonna bother looking exactly what they are. I know that King George or Elizabeth or something like that. I'll give them a clean when I get home. Um, I nearly was gonna give up on that because what it was doing is masking with a bit of um, 
iron. I had a little bit of iron next to it. Um, I thought I'd check it one more time and its signal was getting stronger and better. It turns out to be a coin. I just caught the edge on it just slightly. So, yep, another coin. That's three old coins today. But yeah, it was masked with a little bit of uh, iron. Right, okay, catch you on the next one. Guys, shit me not as soon as I turn the camera off. I'll get another hit directly right beside the one I just dug. And again, that's 70, 74, 75. So it could be another coin. Hey! I can't hear ya! Hang on! Right, let's turn this off and let's in fact we next. Right. Very strong here. And I wouldn't hear it. Oh god, give. World War II shrapnel. Chunked a bit of smell. I don't mind World War II shrapnel, but <laughs> you know, because I want to make key wings out of them. Uh, that is big. That's definitely World War II shrapnel. Give me a good 75 signal. Make sure that ain't worse than that. All right. All right. Okay, catch you on the next one. Well, I did have two little holes in my jean, and suddenly my legs started getting really cold. And what was that? Massive hole. I do have a hit down there, but I can't find it. So I've got another hit there. So we're going to check them out in a second. Sorry about the camera angle again. It's about quarter past twelve, I think, now. Uh, it's just... I ain't going to bother that one. So I've got a hit here somewhere. Got one here. Sixty eight. More of a better target here. Oh, I've just seen Ron talking about the horses, and he said they're probably ones from over that direction. Still in the 60s. Hope it's a silver. Probably ain't. It's not deep enough either yet. It's just a stone. Probably a deep one as well.
That's my boot. bloody aluminium. Oh, that was a good signal as well. Yep, yeah, that's all it was. Bloody aluminium. Bloody left knees hurting. Right, down around this a little bit and then walk back up. Right, I'll uh, catch you on the next one. Right, okay, um, what I'll do is keep this on cold until I get down the bottom. And then I am possibly going to pack up for the rest of the day because my back is hurting. And my knee's getting very cold. And my throat's getting a bit sore. So, so uh, I'll probably pack up a bit earlier today. I'm uh, going to be meeting up with Alan on Monday. So I need to have some strength on Monday. I, I'd, I'm not actually going straight straight home. I'm going to go over the football field and have a look on that um, common bit over there see what it's like. So I'm thinking about maybe trying over there one day. See, so yeah, I don't know how people do their detecting. I kind of walk the way I'm walking. Again, those really high squeak bleeps for a second. And they disappear. I bet there's thousands of coins over here. Is that, I'm not finding them. Well, I found six today. Three old um, King George ones. Half a shilling and a shilling. And uh, no 10p. So I am finding a few coins. But 
I don't know who I'm missing stuff because I'll be doing this build again actually going crosswise not vertical so next time I still need to finish it vertical but I'm going to finish off that on this tree uh, get up to the top and the next time I come in I've got to line myself up down to this tree and then that'd be my starting point but I'm actually going to be packing up in it because I am getting tired my back's hurting and I'm not really finding much apart from the trash just found another bit of uh, shrapnel small piece and nothing else Possibly something there, but pinpoint's not picking it up. So it's seventy seven, could be a coin on its edge. We'll dig it. See what's there. Give anything. Try and make a bigger clod. Stone there. Sunk in there. This is stone. Paving. <sighs> I don't like digging deep holes. I'm not getting nothing going up. I don't think there's anything there. I'm just going to leave it. Unless it's like the pinpoint that can pick it up in the first go, then I'll go for it. But if it can't, well, I ain't going to because, like, it's too bloody tiring. That's so I'm bloody tired right now. My back is killing me. and my knee is getting freezing cold <sighs> I'll leave it, try it next time You 
keep getting them coming up like that. You know, you keep getting them coming up like that, but you can never bloody find them. So too bloody deep. And I am on full sensitivity as well. Melt with uh, aluminium. So it was aluminium. Yeah, as soon as I get the fence, I'll uh, end it. Pack up for a day. Could be the same kind of stuff, aluminium. I don't know if you can see this video guys, sorry you can't. <sighs> Bring it down a bit. I'd like to find another horseshoe actually, fawn. Might be nice. is might be so it. Oh, it says it's not in there. Yeah, that's a stone. I think 
Okay, what's this? Uh, just the back here or something. Yeah, like nothing incredible. Prefer still, I think. No, it's not been a bad day. I found six coins, which is good. When I come next time, I know I've got head and straight line to that tree and do this other half. Might do that next weekend or earlier. I might just find it over there for now. Yep, this is it guys so um hopefully the camera's picked up a bit better today sorry if you haven't been able to see some of the finds uh, also I've got my remote control which is a bit of a bummer Oh, I've got to hit down here guys um, It's going to be awkward with me and my camera today I'm sorry to say I ain't bought the remote control So I've got a 45, 46 here Don't seem too deep It could be a nail It could be one of those U-bend uh, nail things It could be anything I would like to find some more coins though uh, Is that it? I think that might be it Yeah, just a bit of metal scrap Still says there's St. Kels in there though Could be a bit more Yeah more tin that's what it is tin I think I don't think it's pewter that's it that's all it was there's going to be more in a clog don't forget to cover your holes up Got 68, 69. Kind of shallow. I think <laughs> yeah tin can right catch on next all right I've got a hit here bit jumpy
It was going to be 70 a minute ago. Now it's going to be 50. Not be careful with that fence behind me because it's uh, electrocuted. I don't want to have a, a shock up my backside. Now it's going to be 50s. That'd be a nice silver coin. That'd be nice. I think it's metal, of course it's going to be metal. Bit of iron, I think. Yeah. Chunk of iron. Alright, just on the next one. Alright, I've got a hit here. Sorry about the camera. I'm having problems with it again. I'm not used to this camera yet. But anyway, um, got a hit here. 60, 65. Quite a strong one. Hopefully it's a coin or something. So I've not had nothing out apart from a couple of nails. A bit of scrap iron. It could be... I think I'll see it there. It's a horse bridle wing. Well, this is better than the bloody, uh, what's the name? The nail. So that was giving me a 50s. Make sure I ain't anything else there. No. So what I'm doing, I'm walking up and down on this uh, field today. I'm not going to be here too long a day. Don't leave about two o'clock. So I want to go somewhere. Yeah. And have a look. I hate when you get those little bleeps and it's covered with iron. Might be there. That's iron. Let me just, um, Discriminate the iron for me. Oh, it's gone to. I'm turning the touch off and back on. Definitely something in there. Give me 45, but there's iron there as well.
think it's more of this way. Go this way. In this side somewhere, I think. Right, it's in that. I think it's in that clock. Oh, what's this? I think it's just a piece of metal. Just a normal bit of metal. I hope it's a coin, I think. Oh my god, I hope this is a Roman coin. Or is it a button? Oh, I don't know what it is. Oh, it's a button. Yeah. Gene Popper button, what a bummer. Well, there's going to be a Roman coin then. What a bummer. There's something else in there. Give me a higher signal there. 85. Probably a fucking pair of jeans or something. <laughs> Okay. So I had a good signal 85 just then, and it's not there now. Probably the other part of the popper. I'll have a quick check, but I don't think it's going to be in there. Uh, I'm not going to be digging deep holes today either. One thing I ain't going to be doing, digging deep, deep holes. Right, catch you on the next one. Right, okay, so just got a, a hit here, and I can see a round shape, kind of. Might be a coin. And it's an old temporary. Oh, there's two coins there. Oh, not that. Temporary and a shilling. Wow. So I've got two coins today so far. Just check there ain't nothing else down there. Nope. Well, at least I ain't been skunked with coins. At least I've got some coins today, but I was hoping for old coins. Mind you, a shilling. It's no coin in it. So 
not a uh, gold coin, which I was hoping for. Oh, still sank down now. Yep, yeah, I can see another one. Yep, yeah, definitely another one down here, guys. So I've got a coin spill here. What's this one? I've actually caught it. Another half a shilling. Any more? on it. No, that's it. Three coins. Little coin spill. <laughs> Might be picking up a spade. I need to get one of these metal pouches. Now oh, I've got another one of these uh, little digging spades, a brand new one. Right, right next to it, got another hit. Could be more coins there. Gotta dig it. Could be more coins, guys. Might be. Five it says co foil, could be foil, but I don't know until you find it. <laughs> We're not picking up yet, so it might be deeper. in these clumps I think. <laughs> well, not getting on it. <laughs> Well, it's in now. <laughs> Probably just tin foil. <laughs> right, wherever it is, came out. Right, okay. Oh, it's just a uh, little bit of lead, I think. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was a little bit of lead. Oh, there's another coin. <sighs> I 
Right, okay, catch you on the next one. Right, just turned out a bit of a horseshoe here. I was getting a, a remember a 45, I think it was 20, 20, 25 and 45. It's just a horseshoe. Stick that over there for now. Right, catch you on the next one. Got a, a 70 hit here. Well, 63, 65, it was 70 just a minute ago. Not that deep. Could be a coin, hopefully. Might be a, a penny, an old penny. King George or 50. Be happy with that. Be happy with silver. Be even more happy if it's a fucking Roman. Could be lead though, because that gives me a 70 to spoil. Might be more over this side. Yeah, more over there. I don't think it is a coin though. Oh! It's a coin! Nice! Nice patina on it as well. Very nice. Look at that beauty. That's a lovely coin. Probably about one o'clock now anyway. I was going to pack up a two but got on bloody exhausted and my back's hurting. Packing up earlier and it's uh, five to one. Alright, okay guys, that's it for now. Catch you on the next one. Thumbs up if you like the channel. Thumbs down if you don't. Uh, subscribe and hit that notification bell for more videos. And next time, back on the field we've just been on. And then, in a couple of weeks' time, I'm going to start hitting that other field for new permission. Alright, catch you on later.